Hello and welcome back to a little video on Kerbal Space Program. Uh, right here, um, I'm just going to take this video real quick just to show you. Um, I actually just found a uh, an actual use for the EVA suit. Um, a lot of times I find that I don't really see much to do with it. But here you can see this flying off here. And uh, I've got my space station over here that I've been working on. And uh, what I found was I had uh, ejected a piece and it would just kind of sit in there, right? And it would take a long time to float away. But what I did is I got Jeb here into his EVA suit, got behind it, gave it a little push, and now you can see it floating away. Um, and that would just help get your debris further away. Um, obviously, you need to be careful when you're EVA to watch your fuel. You can right-click on your back here to take a look. See, I've got 80%. Um, so I'm in a pretty good place. And the other thing you need to be careful of is to not float away from your actual... Uh, vessel of whatever you're on um, you know it's just a couple things to keep in mind of course uh, but yeah once you're actually out here it's pretty beautiful um, now I was kinda confused about uh, how EVA worked when I first started playing so if you are new to the game let me let you know um, that the EVA suit um, has a jetpack always built in and how that works is when you hit R it puts on the jetpack, and you can see I just pressed R to take it off, so it toggles it on and off. So if I hit R now, it'll turn it on, and here we go, we'll pull out the little arms here, and we're in jetpack mode, or you hit R again, and it goes away. And when it's away, um, you really can't do much at all in space. You could run on the ground, do all that, but you can't do anything when you're just floating around. Um, but if you hit R, in general, it'll pull out your uh, jetpack, regardless of if you're on land or in space. And once it's out, you can use the WASD keys to move left or right, up and down. Um, and by up and down, I mean front and back, because up and down is controlled by shift and control, kind of the way the throttle would be. So if I hit shift here, you can see me come away from it. And if I hit control, you can see me go back towards my, uh, my space station here. So... Um, the last thing I'll do in this video is I'll go ahead and I'll climb back on board. Um, and the way you're going to do that is just go near any one of your hatch doors. And again, you want to be careful here because Jeb actually has enough mass that it is possible for me to uh, to push my space station um, slightly. Which could make, you know, probably not a big deal, but could make it more difficult for me to enter again. Um, so you just have to go ahead and find where your hatch door is. I believe mine is on the other side here, so we're just going to float down. I hit control to bring myself down here. And once we get to the other side here, we're just going to hit shift to kind of slow ourselves down. And shift again. And up we come on the other side, and there's you can see our ladder there. Now the thing is, you can actually grab onto your ladder, and you can grab onto uh, the actual hatch doors. Um, either one is fine. What you do is you just go near it, and you can just kind of float towards it like this. Pretty easy stuff. Once you get near it, you just hit F as soon as it prompts you, and it will prompt you. So as they hit grab, boom, you're grabbed on. And now you're home. You're pretty much in the home stretch. Uh, at this point, you can climb your ladder around and uh, choose where you want to go. If you want to go in this crew hatch, or if you want to go in the top uh, crew hatch for a different, uh, you know, depending on what you have, obviously. Um, and that's why it's really useful to actually add ladders um, to the entire outside of your vessels and things if you have extra, you know, hatches and stuff that you can go in in a space station like this. It makes it pretty sweet that you can, you know, like climb your ladder across the space station instead of having the EVA from place to place. And by EVA, I mean um, the actual jetpack, not just getting outside. Um, because we are doing that right now. And uh, we can take a look at, you know, our beautiful planet below before we go ahead and climb back aboard so we'll go ahead and we'll board up here and you know we can go ahead and uh, take a look here we got a bunch of uh, pals in here that's Jeb he's just excited because he just got back from being outside which he loves the fresh you know not air but he loves the fresh vacuum of space he enjoys it so with that thanks for watching the video hope you learned something and if not I hope you just enjoyed watching you have yourself a great night, everybody.